Marina Bay has changed a lot over the years. Some of you might remember that before all this was built, the area was the go-to place to fly kites, go bowling, or even have cheap steamboats. And if you go even further back, Marina Bay was just the open sea. If you look at this old map of Singapore back in the 1940s, you will notice that Marina Bay did not exist. So how did this become this? To find out how it was done, I caught up with Mr. Ho Wa Hin. He's currently a coastal engineer at Sabana Jurong, one of Tomasik's portfolio companies. The veteran engineer has worked on many land reclamation projects. He says that the reclamation of Marina South and Marina East was special. We are standing here right now uh, is the uh, land reclamation that we carried out uh, in 1979. We got the uh, material actually from Tampines. And actually Tampines at that time actually was the high ground and some hill. So we take the, the material from the high ground, uh, cut it down and form the platform for the housing development estate. And instead of actually throwing away, we actually recycled and bring it over to the marina south here for land reclamation. How do you actually transport those materials over to where we are? Exactly the same as uh, what you see actually in the Japanese restaurant. They transport by the uh, belt conveyor system. Uh, but of course, this uh, conveyor system is much larger and much longer. The belts in this conveyor system are 1400 millimeters in width and total 26,000 meters in length. Do we still flatten hills in Singapore for land reclamation? We don't have uh, such a luxury of uh, having uh, so many hills actually that we can actually use, draw the material from. We still can't avoid to actually have this uh, uh, imported sand from outside, but then uh, this one will keep to the minimum. And the few material we use locally is a major component. Uh, nowadays, actually, this material actually comes from uh, uh, different uh, sources, different construction sites. Uh, MRT, uh, where they so-called dig the, uh, this MRT uh, station or the tunnel. What's the most satisfying part of your job? The work actually is very uh, so-called uh, fulfilling because you can get to see that the, the land actually formed in front of you. Uh, for the project that I'm involved in the Marina East and Marina South, uh, I used to tell my uh, children uh, uh, that actually the land actually I have a hand in actually uh, building it. <laughs>